it is my pleasure to introduce to you Memoria Press's geography curriculum. So geography is a really important skill for students as they learn where places are located in the world, um, as they learn that important skill of mapping, and all of this will help to form a context for them as in later years they study history and classical studies and Christian studies, and they now have a framework uh, for where those places are specifically located. So this is a very fundamental piece uh, for these students that we start with even even at a very young age. In third grade, we like to start our students off with the States and Capitals curriculum. Included in the States and Capitals package is the textbook Don't Know Much About the 50 States, a student guide, a teacher manual, and States and Capitals flashcards. By starting with the United States, uh, students are able to work in the third to fourth grade ages on just a small part of the world and a, a part of the world they're much more familiar with. They'll be able to learn specifically about each state, where it is in location to the rest of the United States. They'll learn the capital, the nickname of the state, postal code, just some interesting facts uh, that will help to give them some context about the country that they live in. Don't Know Much About the 50 States includes age-appropriate visuals and illustrations that will entice the students as they learn about the history behind these states and their interesting facts. The teacher guide and the student guide are going to look very, very similar. The teacher guide will have obviously the answers filled in so that the teacher can easily help lead the class. The student guide will incorporate all of those important things that they're learning from the textbook, just requiring the students to comprehend it. And it'll just be a really great tool for them in those beginning ages as they're just developing the mapping skills and they're just developing being able to read something from a text and then transfer it into a student guide. And then lastly, we do finish with those flashcards, which are incredibly beneficial as the students are being able to recall instantly and at home with parents, with fellow classmates in preparation for tests and quizzes, and they will be fully prepared and be able to recall all of those places that they have previously learned. After your student has completed the States and Capitals curriculum, they are fully prepared to start our Geography 1 curriculum. So included with the Geography set, you'll have your teacher guide, your student guide, uh, a textbook for Geography 1, and then also you'll get a big amount of flashcards. Along with this curriculum, you can also get the United States Review for both the student and teacher. The geography curriculums are specifically tailored to what the students are learning in the rest of their year. So the places that they're learning about in classical studies and Christian studies and the famous men series are corresponding directly to the places that they're learning about in the geography curriculum. So at the fifth grade age level in geography one, they're able to pair those places together um, and be able to have great context for the content they are learning in other areas. As students get older, they're able to expand upon information that they've learned. And so the geography textbook includes information about the countries, some of the historical significance of that country, along with its location, its capital. So students are really um, capitalizing upon uh, all of these different things that they've learned. They have to be spelling accurately. They have to use the mapping skills from states and capitals. And then they're also learning historical context as well. The student guide is going to include all of the major information that they are getting from the text. It's going to include the country itself, where it's located in context to the rest of the region, and they're going to have to map that appropriately. There will also be reviews for them as they prepare for tests and quizzes as well. The teacher guide will look very similar to the student guide. It'll have the answers filled in for them. And then of course, you'll also have the flashcards, which will be the perfect way for the student to prepare for tests and quizzes, to continually be reviewing that information that they have previously learned in class. After your students have completed the Geography 1 curriculum, they are now prepared to go into our Geography 2 curriculum, which is perfect for taking what the students have already learned and then extending it to areas outside of that ancient Roman civilization. So students will learn mapping skills for the Sub-Saharan Africa, uh, they'll learn Asia and Oceania and the Americas, and this will all help to broaden their context of even world events. Included in the Geography 2 package is the Geography 2 textbook and student workbook, a teacher guide, and a review for Geography 1 for both the student and teacher. 
since Geography One included all of those comprehension facts from the text and learning those mapping skills and learning the spelling of these countries and capitals, they honestly are just continuing with that uh, in the Geography Two curriculum, just in different areas of the world. And naturally, different areas of the world will have harder spellings and they will have different historical facts and different interesting contexts in history that these students will be able to learn. So it really is a fundamental piece in the geography curriculum as it really rounds out the rest of the world in what these students are learning. In addition to the student guide, the text, and the teacher guide, you'll also have included in this Geography 2 curriculum a review of Geography 1. So if students need some extra uh, work in that, or if it's just for retention of what they've previously learned, this is an excellent opportunity for those students to review what they've already learned and make sure that they do retain that information for future years. Once your students have worked through the Geography 1 and 2 curriculum, they are now prepared to step into our Geography 3 curriculum. So this would be set around the 8th grade age, and it's important that the students have already had that foundation of Geography 1 and 2 because in Geography 3, uh, the textbook and the student guide is really going to expound upon that information that the students have learned in previous years. This Geography 3 curriculum is paramount in the students being able to take what they've learned in the past and then bring it into the present and be able to see how the world works together as a whole, how all of these locations and information work together and influences the studies that they are going to continue to do using the Memoria Press curriculum. Included in your set, you will have the student guide and the teacher guide, and the teacher guide is going to be a wonderful resource for anybody who's leading the course, as it will include the information filled in that the students are required to know, along with uh, teaching guidelines, quizzes, tests, answer keys will all be included in one resource for you. This study guide is going to look slightly different from our Geography 1 and 2. It looks a little bit more outline-based as the students are older and can take more notes and, and have more comprehensive answers from the text. There's going to be a classroom atlas that the students can have right at their fingertips that will be such a colorful depiction and representation of charts and maps that show climate and maps that show uh, statistics within the country. The textbook is going to go into deeper historical content and it's going to talk more about what the country was able to do in the, in the outline of history. It's, it's going to go into more geographical and cultural terms, whereas in years past it relied primarily on mapping skills um, and locations. So the Geography 3 curriculum really does take geography a step further and it helps the students to understand the importance of learning topography and learning culture and and religion and society and how it all works together uh, to make up the study of our world. Geography is a fundamental skill for students to learn as they are for the first time learning about the world around them and their place in it. If you have any further questions about this geography program, please feel free to call us and one of our customer service representatives would be happy to help you. Thank you. Mm -hmm.